Oh, what's going on, y'all? It's been a minute, but spring is finally here. Riding season's back. If y'all not familiar with my channel, 2019 Speed Twin, uh, DNA air filter, a Motone X pipe, nuke slip ons. With that being said, let's go make some racket. It's still a little cold, but man, I've been dying to ride. All bikes are fun. to get out and ride last week i seen a horrific motorcycle wreck it's kind of fucked my head a little bit uh, i was out going on delivery at work going through uh downtown loganville and a bike shoots right by me it was like a i believe it was like a honda fury the little custom thing with bright blue chrome so that's a nice bike he shoots by me i'm going about 35 it's 120 ish lunchtime in loganville so it's just fucking packed with people this guy comes flying by me two cars about 30 40 yards in front of me uh, dart into to Walmart the white car and they had a maroon truck the white car darted I kind of cringe because I seen the bike coming I didn't realize the fucking maroon truck was like right on that car's ass in pulling in too and boom this dude explodes against the side of his fucking truck the bike and truck go into the Walmart shopping center. He shoots up 15, 20 foot in the air. Fucking hits the ground. Not even moving. Every one of his limbs is fucking broken in a different which way. I mean, his body was goddamn mangled, man. He was so fucked up. Well, <laughs> I was on the phone with the other driver. I think we were talking about a job site I was going to that I wasn't familiar with. And he said, I said, holy shit, about 30 fucking times. <laughs> that was one of the most fucked up things I've seen. And it's always in the back of your mind out here when you're riding. Like, you know, especially like when you come through around these neighborhoods and people come flying up the edge of the street. You think, please see me, please see me, please see me. But, man, that was like a reality check. So I, hell, I was talking to him on the phone. I said, fuck that shit. I'm selling all my bikes. I'm buying video games. <laughs> that was so fucked up. Oh, man. It was so fucked up. But later that day, I found out that they life flighted the guy. Um, he was in intensive care. He was 55. Uh, the, the maroon Chevy truck that he hit, the driver of that was 82. And it was kind of both their faults. He was hauling ass through middle of town, probably going 55, 60 when he hit the side of that truck. And then, you know, the, the old dude, the 
was jumping behind that other car, man. He, they, they both probably didn't see the guy, and it's it just like I said, man. A fucking reality check. How quick? I'm surprised the guy. I thought he was dead when I passed him. I'm surprised he fucking he. I, I don't care amount the the amount. You couldn't wear enough gear to survive that shit. His helmet stayed on though, which is surprising. That's that's reassuring. I wouldn't survive that hit. I mean, sh if I, if I did, I mean, I'm sure that guy, that guy's never gonna be right ever. I mean, ugh. like I said, it was horrific. I've seen a lot of fucked up shit over the years. Being an over the road truck driver and shit, I've seen a lot of a lot of bad wrecks. God, a lot of bad wrecks. But that was by far one of the most fucked up things I've ever seen. I mean, I I don't know. Well, hell. Well, I'm about to stop and get some fuel. Y'all be safe out there, man. Till next time. Later.